So a lot of you guys have been asking about my ticket dominus, and a lot of you don't even know what tickets are on Roblox because you weren't around when they were a thing. So I'm going to show you guys some of the ticket hats because it's been a while since I've done this, and the last video I did did pretty well. So I want to do another one. I want to show you guys because a lot of you guys don't know. I haven't done a kind of a story on the ticket hats or the ticket dominus in a long time. So if you guys remember, Roblox used to have tickets. Now if I type in Roblox tickets blog, it should have a blog post on tickets. Let's see, saying goodbye to tickets, the Roblox blog. I'm going to kind of give you guys, I mean, these are the tickets. And look, here is all the ticket items, which we're going to take a look at because I have most of these. Um, saying goodbye to tickets so i'm gonna show you guys all their super rare hats that kind of are forgotten about like i own this it's a really cool dominus it, it it actually is it's a really cool dominus and i sold all my limiteds to get it i'm not gonna lie it was it has very very few owners all the owners wear it most of the time i mean it's i'm very happy to have it i'm so glad i can have one of the ticket dominuses it's one of the best items on roblox in my opinion so um, I mean, I, th I think it's super cool. You guys can let me know what you think, but I think it looks really dope. I think my outfit looks super, super chill. Um, saying goodbye to tickets. They said, dear Roblox community, in the next 30 days, Roblox will discontinue tickets. This is one of the biggest changes we've ever made to our platform. While many of you will welcome this change, I know that many of you will be concerned. I want to explain our reasoning here and also share details of the process we will be going through with this migration. Nine years ago, Eric Castle, John Chodletsky, Matt Dusek, and I designed the original Roblox economy. At the time, virtual currency was a new concept and it typically only used in online MMOs. Virtual worlds like Second Life and Club Penguin were popular and social platforms like Facebook were just coming into existence. Smartphone mobile gaming did not exist yet. So they pretty much fueled the economy with tickets. How you could get tickets was you sell clothing or you make a game. When someone joins your game, you would get one ticket. You could then transfer tickets for Robux. It used to be about 18 tickets was one Robux. Now think about it now. If jailbreak, I understand why they did this. Imagine now if one, if 18 tickets were one Robux now, jailbreak has a billion visits. That is a billion tickets. They would have made another $100 million of real money just through place visits because it used to get one ticket for each visit. Here's a list Here's a list of current changes. Developers will no longer receive tickets on a place visit. Users will no longer get tickets for, you, for logging in. Price floor is lowered on shirts and pants to five Robux. First gift appear in the catalog shortly after a future announcement. So you used to be able to sell clothing for one ticket, which I sold all my clothing for one ticket because I had it up just so people could buy it. After 30 days, the following will happen. Trade currency will close. Users will no longer able to be exchanged currency with one another. You used to be able to trade with people tickets and Robux. User ads will be available for purchase in Robux only. Users and developers can no longer sell their items for tickets. Tickets will no longer be visible or usable. Then the ticks of Palooza happened. They started out with this. It was 10 tickets, right? It was 10 tickets. This little thing was 10 tickets. Now, it doesn't show you if you click on it because it's unfortunate and it doesn't do that. But I think I have most of these items. So we're going to go stroll through my inventory. We're going to look. Now, these, not rare. None of these are rare. Once you start getting into the 100,000, 75,000, then things start to get rare. And take note, guys. This is when a lot of people weren't rich. People didn't have hundreds of thousands of people playing their game a day. They had, you know, maybe the max game ever was 12,000 people playing at once. And that was max. That's like a record back then, 2016. So as you get up the list, these get rarer and rarer and rarer. And super rare. And then from, I'd say from the Tix Valk on, things started to get real rare. Um, Tix Wings, t is, is, as 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 etc. Ticket fan, I have the hardest time saying the word etc. I don't know why. Then we have the Lord of the Tixuration, the Tix Domino, and the Dominus Peticium. Honestly, my favorite. Um, I'm gonna show you guys. I have most of these hats. I had to sacrifice a few so that way I could. Um, that way I could. I was able to get the other, the bigger ticket hat. I had to sacrifice some little ones to get the big ones. Unfortunately, it is what it is. If we scroll down a ways, I'll be able to start seeing where I see the tickets. Here we have the paper ticks hat. That one was 500 tickets. That one was 500 tickets. So there is the ticks valk. 
I'll click on that. We got Etcetera and Tix Fan, Lord of the Tix Duration, Tix Domino Crown, my Dominus. I'll click back on. I'll bring up all the whole list of them. I'm pretty sure I didn't even buy the super small things because I was so focused on saving each ticket for um, the big purpose and the big item. So let's see that, 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 that. Okay, let me go to, I don't know if I bought the hair or not, the tick hair. I really don't think I did because I think it was too much and I couldn't afford either the Domino Crown or the Dominus, which obviously was the main goal to get the big ones. Yeah, I did not get the hair, which is a shame because not a lot of people have it. So this is the Tix Valk. This one has more owners than all the other ones, of course, because it's a Valkyrie. I really do hope they make it limited one day just because it'll be cool to have it floating around. And then also the Excedrin Tix fan. This one was, hold on, wrong page. This one cost 1 million tickets, 1 million. Lord of the Tix Duration cost 1.5 million tickets. Tix Domino was 2.5 million and then Dominus Protecium was 5 million. Tix Valk was 500,000. I bought the Ticket Bling. I bought the Top Hat. I bought Tix Vision, I believe. I really hope I did. I don't think I did either. I don't think I bought it. I really don't. I really don't think I bought Tix Vision. Honestly, I don't even know where it would be at this point because I have to waste so many items, dude. And now they're not going to load in because Roblox hates me right now, apparently. But, yeah, I mean, this one, I don't think has that many owners at all. It doesn't. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. It has about 25 owners. Maybe 29. I think it was with someone between there. I counted. This was the Lord of the Ticks duration. This is actually really good looking on your character. I think it actually looks really cool. Building the games. Um, he has all of them as well, I believe. This one does not have many people on it that own it as well. I mean, it's a really rare hat. So these you don't really ever see around Roblox, even though they are super rare. You don't like ever see people wearing them. The owners, they're kind of inactive, honestly. There's some people who quit, and they just don't have them anymore. This one is the Ticket Domino Crown. This one, honestly, is way too big and bulky. I wish it wasn't. I love it. If, it, they, if this was skinny, dude, I would be wearing this 24-7. It's kind of big, as you can see. I'll show you um, Corvette's character. Um, it is a bit big. It's a bit big as you can see. It's kind of round on the head. I would say it's still cool. It is still cool, but it's not, uh, you know, the best. I'm gonna I'm gonna go to the Dominus last, cause, just cause it's really cool. Um, yeah. So this is the Tix visor. Everyone has this. It was like, what was this? This was really cheap. This was 25 tickets. So everyone has the ticket visor, and it's. Honestly, guys, if you don't remember tickets, I'm sorry. You guys can look it up. Tickets used to be a huge part of Roblox, and I hope you do look it up if you have, if you don't know what tickets are because I feel like it's such a big part of Roblox. I really do want you guys to see it because they're super, super cool. And this was the ticket beanie. I think this is like, what, 250 Yep, 250 And the paper was 700 I think, 500 So that's the paper ticks hat. Um, this one actually looks pretty cool. That's why I bought it, and I think it's just really cool overall. And then, of course, we have the big one with all the thumbs up, all the favorites, 15000 um, there's old Shedletsky, as you guys know. He's, like, helped with Roblox so much over the years. Um, yeah, I'm friends with him on this account. Really, really cool. We used to trade a lot, and I used to talk to him on the forums. So it's really cool just to be a big part of that because it's such a big website with so many millions of users. So it's kind of cool that I'm kind of like an OG, you know? So that is that, and I, I have it on my character, as you guys saw, and it's just super cool. Now, I wanted to check because I thought that I may have the – ticket wings but i was not sure i do have the ticks wings that's one that i totally forgot about these are the ticks wings um i'm gonna wear them honestly i'm gonna wear them and i'm gonna refresh my character so we can see what it looks like i want to have on the ticket wings with the ticket hat i mean come on that's such the combo you know and they're like kind of like really like bony looking which is kind of cool i guess and it just makes me look like i'm floating in tickets and i think that's cool because i miss tickets honestly so over the next 30 days we'll be selling exclusive commemorative items as a send off for tickets yeah guys I mean it's sad but if you guys want to check out the blog post then I'll have um, the link in the top of the description I do want to go join a game and so you guys can see what the ticket items look like because I feel like that would be cool um, yeah I'm just gonna join a simple game like I'm just gonna join this this parkour game again because you just spawn and I'll just show you guys uh, how it looks I feel like the tickets are actually, the ticket items are really cool in my opinion. So you guys can, uh, you know, have your own opinion or whatever. But if you guys like them, drop a thumbs up. I really, 
I, I really miss tickets, especially after seeing all this. The wings are completely trash. I'm not going to lie. These are so ugly. But, you know, it's a part of Roblox. And they did, I mean, how, how cool can you make a wings? How, how cool can you make wings look when you're adding, you're just throwing tickets together, you know? But, I mean, they did a decent job. But the Dominus is honestly really, really good looking, I feel like. It's just a better Arius, in my opinion. It's got the ticks and the T for the tickets and then the ticks wings. I think it just looks really good overall. Um, but yeah, you guys can be the judge. If you guys like this, make sure to drop a thumbs up and comment down below. I wanted you guys to see this because it's been, like I said, it's probably been seven, eight months since I did this. So if you guys enjoyed this video, guys, make sure to hit the thumbs up button and subscribe to the channel. And if you guys are new, make sure to turn on the bell when you subscribe so you guys never miss a video. Thank you guys for watching. You guys can follow me on my social media if you want. The links will be in the description to my Twitter and Instagram. Or you can add me on Snapchat and see when I post stories. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.